well, it's silly, but Pina Coladas from Pina Colada Island in uh, Thailand. Anyway, swam out, we broke their canoe, really sorry. Um, but yeah, you get like a Pina Colada in a, in a coconut. Anyway, yes, I like those and I also, I, you wanna buy me a drink? Uh, Cafe Patron on ice with a squeeze of fresh lime. No, okay, I have to set the record straight here. Claire is a soldier. She, you know, my backstory is she's, you know, raised a military brat. She follows order. The colonel talking to her like that, that is, that is what happens in the military. She is an absolute soldier first. So stop feeling sorry for her. She's got bigger balls than you. And she loves it when the colonel talks to her like that because that's actually how he shows her respect. All right? No, no, no. Uh, yes, I'm very undisciplined. And yeah, nothing like Claire. That's why she's absolutely a dream to play because that's why you act to be not yourself. So um, yeah, nothing, nothing like each other. I don't know, just it, it's more like what was happening behind the scenes. Like for example, when Jackson shoots the cigarette into my mouth and you know, we have lots of innuendo jokes around here cause none of us are grown up. So that was probably, yeah, one of them that sticks out, but not for the scene, but yeah. Mine? Well, Claire, Claire likes guns and I like guns. So there, there's a similarity. We like the feeling. Uh, Amanda likes prop guns. Claire likes real guns. Let's clarify. Absolutely. Uh, I learned a lot of great skills from Natasha Ristich, who is, is a very composed actress and, you know, I'm a goofball. Uh, so I, I pick up her actual personality restraint, even though she's funny as all hell, um, to help me get through the scene, especially with David Ashby. Yes. <laughs> David is not my favourite because he throws them, and but it is fun. Um, so then he probably is my favourite actually, yeah. Because if he throws a scene and if something happens later on in the day and you feel like, you know, you cost the production money, you're like, well, David does it. <laughs> But yeah, and making out with Sean, always fun. The last scene we shot for season one, we were all there and it was one where we were all kind of in a booth together and they yelled rap and it was the end and everyone knew it was the end and I just started crying and then Kate, a magnificent producer who I'm in love with, uh, came out and they gave us little presents and I'm there <laughs> and she's like, oh, I had money on you as the crier. And it was, yeah, it was just that kind of, apex moment um, yeah it was really beautiful yes I work out I work out on a Total Gym XLS uh, if you haven't seen it Google Chuck Norris Total Gym it may be a photo of us splashed together anyway uh, yes so something you might notice from the two different seasons is that my body shape has changed and that was for health reasons uh, but the Total Gym has changed my life you want to see my abs Okay, I'm really white and that's probably really hairy, but uh, yes, I work out. <laughs> um, I have a very large group of people who get paid a lot more money than I do, because uh, that's what it takes to make clay. <laughs> so it is fun coming to work and having people make you look quite nice. Much of the same, she's, she's very focused. She will always be the focused force. And um, I don't know, it's so hard not to give it away. But yeah, no, she kicks ass. I'm proud of her. If possible, more bizarre. Um, uh, and we have a bit more money, so it might look a bit better. <laughs> so, but not good, not better enough that it takes away from its its charm. 